All right, so in this problem, we are multiplying to multiplying a whole number by a decimal. So in this case, we want to line up all of our numbers so they align and not by the not by the decimal. Um, in contrast with adding and subtracting, we always wanted to line up our decimals. In multiplication, we will not. We want to line up all of our numbers ac accordingly, um, ignoring the decimal. So now we have a regular long multiplication problem. So we're going to start by multiplying the 6 by all the numbers above. So 6 times 1 is 6. 6 times 7 is 42. 6 times 8 is 48 plus 4, which gives us 52. And now we're going to move on to our next column. We can erase the numbers that we carried over. And we're also going to place a placeholder because we're moving one column to the left. So now we have 0 times 1 is 0, and actually all the numbers you will multiply by 0 will be 0. And so now we will move on to our next 0, and we're going to place two placeholders this time. So now again, when we multiply all of our numbers by 0, we get 0. And now all we have to do is add up all of our numbers in each column, and we'll take care of our decimal after. So we have 6 plus zeros, which is 6, 2, 2, and 5. So now we're going to place our decimal by the amount of numbers we have after the decimal and the numbers we multiplied. So 871 has no, there's no numbers after the decimal, but in 0 0.06, we have two places after the decimal, meaning that we are going to move two places to the left. So our final answer is going to be 52.26